Hi all, welcome back to channel. Today in this video, it will give you an insight into the easy configuration of Helpdesk team in Odoo 15. The user will get access to the module from the home dashboard. The moment you open the module, Odoo will display the overview window of the Helpdesk. From this overview, we can observe and manage all configured teams in the module. The details regarding the tickets assigned to each team can be obtained. To create a new team for uh, helpdesk operation, you will get a dedicated platform in this module. For getting access to this platform, we can go to the configuration and can choose the helpdesk team option. The window can be viewed in the Kanban view as well as in the list view. In the list view, we will get the name, alias, email and the company. To configure a new helpdesk team, we can click on the create icon. Here in this window, we can provide the necessary details. So here in this field, we can provide the name for the new team. Let it be ABC team. Along with this, the main purpose and objective of this team can be mentioned in the description for the customer portal. You can specify the name of the company in the window if you are working in a multi-company environment. So it can, be, it can be chosen from the drop down menu. In the new team creation window, we will get the assignment and visibility, channels, track and build time, performance, self service and after sales field to define. In the assignment and visibility field, you will get two options to describe such as assignment method and team visibility. The assignment method will help you to decide how to assign new tickets to the right employees. By selecting the manual option, you can manually assign tickets to the employees. The random option will distribute tickets randomly and each employee will get the same number of tickets. By selecting the balanced option, Odoo will assign tickets to the person who has the least number of tickets. The visibility to the team can be set as all users or invited users. If you want to restrict the visibilities to the team for invited users only, you can specify their name in the additional field that appears after enabling the invited users. So we can add the users here in this field. In the channel field, we can activate the email alias which will help you to generate helpdesk ticket by sending an email. You will get an additional field to configure a custom domain for this. By activating the live chat feature, you will be able to collect support tickets from customers through the live chat. The customer can create a new ticket by typing on helpdesk in live chat. It is also possible to provide a website form for your customers to submit their queries. For this, we can enable the website form option. Using this feature, a customer can generate support tickets from the company website. Odoo will automatically save the tickets in the helpdesk module and assign a team to manage them. Now the track and build time field will help you to track and build the time spent on the tickets. The timesheet field can be activated to record the time taken to complete the task which is created to solve the ticket with the help of the project module. The time billing option can be activated to re-invoice the recorded time on the task to the concerned customer. The performance field contains SLA policies and customer rating options to activate. The SLA policies are used to ensure that the tickets are managed and closed on time. These policies will set some rules for the timely management of tickets submitted by the customers. So we have already done a video regarding how to manage SLA policy in Odoo 15 helpless module. To get in detail, you can simply search on Cybros's YouTube channel. After closing a ticket, the customer can rate the performance of the team of a company according to their satisfaction. To collect their ratings, you can enable the customer rating feature. Here we have the option to set an email template on the stages and also we can enable the publish this team's rating on your website option. It is possible to post the queries from customers on a forum which will give you an opportunity to the other participants to answer. 
to allow your website visitors to answer each other's question, you can activate the community forum option from the sales service field. Similarly, we can share videos and presentation regarding the solution to the ticket in the form of a course by enabling the e-learning option. So we can choose the course from the drop down menu. To close the inactivated tickets automatically, you can use the automatic closing feature. Odo will close all inactive tickets automatically after activating the concerned option. If a customer wants to close his or her own ticket, it is possible to close them from the help desk page of the website. To allow your customers to close their tickets, you can enable the closure by customers option. And finally, here we have the after sales field. We can activate the certain option to provide suitable customer support. If the customer demands a refund, we can issue credit note by activating the refund option. You can also provide a return option to customers to return faulty product to the company by enabling the returns feature. The field service option will help you to convert the ticket into the field service task. So we can choose a project from the drop down menu. By clicking on the external link, we will get the detailed view. You can easily grant discount coupons and free product to customers using the Open option. For any kind of damage, you can send the product for repair using the repair option. So the new help desk team can be saved using the save button. The smart buttons available on the screen will give information regarding the tickets assigned for this team. Total hours spent uh, by the team on various tickets, number of repairs and SLA policies can be seen here. And here we have the option to go to website to publish the new ticket. When a customer submits a ticket, Udo will automatically assign the ticket to the concerned help desk team based on the assignment method selected. The assigned team will take adequate action to resolve the issue and close the ticket as soon as possible. So that's all about the video. Thank you for watching. Thank you.